Greetings, Town of Nantucket employees. Thank you for joining us today for this HR briefing. Today is Friday, March 27th, and I wanted to start off today by acknowledging our school educators and administrators for all that they've done during the state of emergency. They provided virtual resources and tools to our children across the island to continue their learning during the state of emergency. So thank you so much for your creativity and your support during this time. I also wanted to take a moment to acknowledge the Nantucket Cottage Hospital and share a hashtag that we're going to be using on our social media. It's hashtag thank you NCH. Um, so if you take a photo or you um, share your artwork on social media, tag the town of Nantucket and we'll be posting pictures on our uh, social media accounts thanking Nantucket Cottage Hospital. And I have a couple examples I wanted to share with you today. Um, the first is Greg's. Thank you, Nantucket Cottage Hospital. And another one is from Michelle. Thank you, NCH. So keep them coming and we'll post more over the weekend on our social media. Um, while you're home staying safe and saving lives, take some time to complete the 2020 census. I know I got something in the mail recently reminding me about the 2020 census, so it's very easy. Go online and complete that while you're home. Uh, mark your calendars. The next virtual select board meeting is on April 1st at 6 o'clock p.m. And it can be viewed online, live, uh, via YouTube, or you can watch it on Channel 18. Uh, benefits. So yesterday I spoke about health insurance, and today I wanted to address questions related to flexible spend. Um, for those who hold flexible spending accounts through TASC, the carryover amount is $500, and that plan year ends on June 30th. So please be aware that that is the only balance you can carry over as of July 1st. So now's the time to go online, check your account balances, and see how much you have. Um, as of today, there hasn't been any IRS or federal changes to the amount that can be carried over or the length of time that it can be carried over. So um, go online and make sure you um, know the balance in your account. Um, as of now, the annual benefits fair will be held virtually. Um, you can still make changes, enroll or cancel benefits or add benefits um, during our open enrollment period. And that is May 1st through May 31st. Um, you can make changes by emailing HR directly at hr.nantucket-ma.gov or you can contact our participating vendors directly as well. Um, please review your pay stubs this week and if you have any questions related to the policies that you hold, please let us know. Um, just a reminder that our vacation carryover policy has changed. Um, previously, you had six months to carry over vacation time and now we are allowing 12 months of unused vacation time to be carried over. And we will be posting an updated carryover form to our website next week. Um, please remember your cybersecurity training from January and Karen's expert advice um, regarding accessing personal information or bank accounts while you're using wireless connections. Um, now that many of us are working from homes, it's very important to be vigilant in protecting your personal information and thinking before you click on any link. Uh, update from the EOC. I no update to the report on municipal office closures. We are still closed until April 6th. Um, public schools closed until May 4th. And as of today, um, no changes to the emergency orders that remain in effect. Um, and I'll just reiterate that any questions that you have related to the emergency orders, you can email COVID-19 at police.nantucket-ma.gov or you can call 508-325-4111. Um, also, the Household Hazardous Waste Day that was scheduled for April 11th has been canceled, and the next waste day is June 13th. Um, in closing, I just want to reiterate that all of our information is on the town website under COVID-19, and please visit it daily to get the most up-to-date information. Stay home, stay safe, and we are urging those who are traveling domestically or internationally to stay home for a voluntary 14-day quarantine. If you have any questions um, regarding any of the information I've shared today, please email us at hr at nantucket-ma.gov. Thank you.